11th maths class and in previous class we have learned till question number 9 of exercise 1.1 chapter number 1 that is integers now today in this class we will proceed with question number 10 of exercise 1.1 so question number 10 Now question number ten is a little bit longer question, so just understand this question very clearly and grab this question into your mind so that you can easily understood its concept. Okay. Now question is saying a water tank has steps inside it. A monkey is sitting on the topmost step, that is the first step. The water level is at ninth step. means there are total 9 steps so there are 9 steps suppose this is first step this is second this is third this is fourth fifth sixth seventh eighth
So this is our eleventh jump. This is monkey's eleventh jump. Now question is asking in how many jumps the monkey reached the water level. So how many jumps? Total eleven jumps. So you have to write. If you want to draw this, then you can draw this in your fact notebook. Okay. Now monkey. Monkey reach the water level. Monkey reach the water level in eleven jumps. Okay, monkey reach the water level in eleven jumps. You have to first go. Three steps down, then two steps up. Now, since the board is not three D, so I am just drawing this number line and explaining you through this number line only. Now, if you want to see the three D picture, then your book on your book, page number five, you have the three D picture also. You can use that picture also to calculate the answer. Okay, students. This is your question number ten, first part. Now let's come to second part. Now the second part is question is saying after drinking water. He wants to go back. For this, he jumped four steps up and then jumped two steps down in every move. In how many jump will he reach back the top step? Okay. So means after drinking water means now the lion is here. Uh, sorry, it's not the lion. It's the monkey. The monkey is here. Now, after drinking water, he wants to go back. For this, he jumped four steps up and then jumped two steps down. Means four steps up. So one, two, three, four. Four steps will come here. So monkey will jump from ninth to fifth step and then two steps down means seventh step. So I'll do this with another color chalk. So that you can understand. Now four steps, four steps down, and then two steps again. So this is two steps. Now again four steps. So one, two, three, four means four steps. Again, two steps down. Then four steps here. So this is his first jump. This is his second. This is third jump. This is fourth, and this is his fifth jump. So how many jumps in total? So in total, there are. Five jump, okay. In total, there are five jumps. So you can write like monkey will reach back in five jumps. Okay, students. Now similarly, third part. Third part is if the number of steps moved down is represented by negative integer and the number of steps moved up by positive integer, represent his moves in part one and part two by completing the following. This part is your homework. I am explaining you how will you do this. The A. Is asking that minus three plus two. 
Now how many times will I have to repeat this so that it will become minus 8. Now just simply see minus 3 plus 2 will give us minus 1. Now similarly if we write minus 3 plus 2 again this will give us minus 1 again. Now this minus 1 and minus 1 when we add this gives us minus 2. Now what answer we have to find? We want that this sum will give us minus 8. Now if we are writing like this. Now how many times we have to write this to get minus 8? How many times have we have to write this continuously to get minus 8? So just write this continuously 7 more times to get minus 8. This is very easy. Just try doing this at home. Similarly, B part is also there. 4 minus 2. 4 minus 2. Now how many times you have to repeat this to get? How many times you have to repeat this to get? 8. How many times you have to repeat this to get 8? So just repeat this and until you get 8. Okay students? So this is your question number 10 and I hope you understood this question. Now from exercise 1.2 we will do in next class. Till then, thank you. Keep studying.